How's Brad? How you doing today? Off uh, goofing around out in the uh, mountains in uh, Colorado here. And um, people ask us, you know, every now and then, what on earth would you ever do with a knife that small? Well, you know, um, I could maybe win a beer uh, at the bar if I said, I bet you a beer my knife is smaller than your knife. See if anybody takes you up on it. Um, what could you do with a knife like that? Well, you could probably use it for cleaning your fingernails. And I use it actually a lot on uh, peeling oranges. So let's check and see what we got for sharp. And this is new right out of the package. Okay, that's, that's really not too bad. I can kind of slice along there like that. They actually do a pretty good job of sharpening them. So let's uh, put just a little bit of sharp on it. See how it turns out here. Right now, see I don't need that serious radius going in there like that. I don't even notice that there's a radius on that blade because all I got to do is just go from the handle towards the point of the knife just like that. Slide it right on out there. And we're going to turn the knife over here in a few seconds and do it again. Just like that. Turn it up this way so you can see a little bit better. Okay, now I'll just pinch it, turn it over. Put my finger under the blade, tilt it down like this. Go right on out, right on around. You know what? I'll bet that would be a really good knife for uh, getting a fish, actually. If you got the fish turned up, go in from the bottom and right on up, that might work. So let's see. We do this for a little while longer. Don't press too hard. Let it work. Don't make it work. Just like that. And turn it over. Do it again. And a little bit more on this side. A little bit more on that side. And a little bit here. A little bit there. A little bit there. A little bit there. Oh, that bites. Alright, let's see. And it's still pretty sharp. They had it pretty sharp. I'm a little bit amazed uh, how sharp it was. It is sharper though. I can go further in one pass. It <laughs> All right. This is what I do mostly with my little one inch knife. Come up here about like that, stick it in the orange, and just go right on around. That way you don't have to worry about the depth of your cut very much. Just like that. Take your orange, run your finger in there like that. Oops. Like that. This orange is actually pretty soft. Yeah, where's my other cut? There it is. Yeah, it's oh, gonna come juicy. apart. Oh, I tell you what. Um, yeah, this orange is is really ripe. This is juicy. But anyways, ooh, she's sour though. That's what I do with it. Stick it in there and run it right around. Just cut the skin on the orange, peel it right off of there. This is Brad, SharpensBest.com. Take care and have a good day.